Welcome to Your Faith Update. I was just a little boy and my mom took all of us to the circus. There we went under that big tent and wow, what we saw was amazing. The lions, the tigers, and the elephants all performing in lockstep. It was amazing how they could train those animals to do the tricks that they did. But there was one, one act that really stood out in my mind. It was the tightrope walker. There he was, high above all of us in that tent. And he got on that tightrope, and he had to find his balance and keep his balance all the way across. If he failed to keep his balance, he would fall to his death. Boy, I sat on the edge of my seat, biting my nails, so worried and concerned for his safety. He made it, though, and he did fine. But you want to know something? As believers, we also have to perform a balancing act. I'm sorry to say that not all Christians come out all right. But I trust that as we go through life, we find balance in the Christian life. You say, what is that balance? Well, sometimes we misunderstand that balance as somehow being able to function in the flesh or in the world and still maintain a relationship with the Lord. No, it's not a matter of maintaining sin and the Savior or balancing those two. No, not at all. The Christian life is about balancing the good and the best. There's so many responsibilities that God has given to us as believers, and yet we have to be careful that even in the midst of that service and doing those good things, that we don't forget about the best thing, and that's Him. See, our relationship with Jesus Christ is the best thing, and we need to be focused on Him and striving to draw nigh to Him. The other things are good, and, and we need them in our life, but we need to balance the good and the best. The writer in Philippians, the Apostle Paul, says in chapter 3, verse 10, that I may know Him and the power of His resurrection and the fellowship of His sufferings being made conformable unto His death, that I may know Him, he says. The Apostle Paul was doing a lot of good things, but he couldn't neglect the best. Like that tightrope walker, you and I have to find balance and maintain balance in our Christian lives. And that balance is between the good and the best. That balance is between even our service for Christ and our relationship with Him. May God help us to maintain proper balance and get from this to the other side without falling. God bless you.